Liu Yangdong's two-day visit to New York City was action-packed. She dined with former U.S. Secretary of State Henry Kissinger, nicknamed Old Friend of the Chinese People. She watched a youth basketball game with Yao Ming, the first Chinese basketball player in the National Basketball Association. And she spent a large portion of her time highlighting the growing educational ties between China and the U.S. At New York University, Liu was rewarded the Medal of Honor, the highest honor given by that establishment. And here at Columbia University, she spoke out about the importance of the China-U.S. relationship, along with leaders of business, culture, and diplomacy. Never before have our two countries shared such extensive common interest and shouldered such important common responsibilities. Just as President Xi Jinping said, we have 1,000 reasons to make China-U.S. relations good and not a single reason to derail this relationship. Henry Kissinger, who helped broker the normalization of China-U.S. relations 45 years ago, echoed the sentiment. What started as a strategic move by both China and the United States has evolved into an absolute prerequisite for world order. Billionaire Steve Schwartzman spoke about the role education can play in fostering peaceful relations between the two nations. He has invested $100 million in a new scholarship program that brings students from around the world to Beijing. This project is a true collaboration between China and the United States and many other parts of the world to help build greater understanding and deeper ties between the next generations of leaders around the world. Liu's visit to New York focused mainly on education and culture, but will take on a more political tone when she co-chairs an event in Washington with U.S. Secretary of State Rex Tillerson. Karina Huber, CGTN, New York.